Anybody who reduces this struggle to know but Mao is offside. Young people of DP, I am building this for you so that tomorrow you have a viable party. I don't have to be president. In politics, you fight, but you also negotiate because you, make, you know, must know what you want. These people are getting tired, and Uganda is also tired of them. But there are also people inside there who don't want to collapse with the system. <clears throat> Those ones, we must also work with them. So these guys who are insulting me, they are saying, oh, we are here saying we are removing a dictator. We are saying, but what if this man is also taking another parallel line which is invisible? But eventually he will erupt somewhere there with his DP. I wish the Lord Mayor good luck. It is a great day when a person who has been cohabiting finally gets married. Is it not a great day? So today is his graduation day from a cohabitation to a marriage. After all, those who are cohabiting do everything that married people do. Is there anything they don't do? They even have children. The Museveni regime has managed to rule Uganda for so long because of its divide and rule politics. A man who claims a copyright to the vision of East African unity and Pan-Africanism is busy balkanizing and dismembering the social fabric of Uganda. Each clan can now get a district on demand. The only condition is total allegiance to Museveni. We are going to continue protesting this life presidency project. The most important thing is that Ugandans are waking up. DP spent over 400 million shillings building unity. And we thought we would work together. We didn't know that these people actually were working for some elements within NRM. That's why I have called out NOOP for being an NRM project. Actually, if NRM was honest, NOOP shouldn't even be on the register of political parties because they have a fake constitution, they had no delegates conference, all those people who were elected on NOOP should become independents. As the DP bloc, we are not fighting to lead the opposition, we are fighting to lead government because we were never created to be permanently in the opposition. We are confident of our capacity as a party. A party which is 65 years old, whose leader was slaughtered, but the party remained standing. DP always puts Uganda first. We just, we just don't say it. You can check our record. For the sake of Uganda, DP even cooperated with NRM in its early days. For the sake of Uganda, DP welcomed the former National Political Commissar of the NRM. I hear he brought this analogy that I bet numbers and the areas of Kwago and the Sewanyana are like a watermelon is. We are green outside and red inside. Indeed, that is it. It is true. We are also aware that some people, like him, are also like a pumpkins. They are green outside but yellow inside. So there is there will no there will be no way the pumpkins will love the watermelons because their color inside is different. We only share the color outside, but inside for me I'm red and for him is yellow. You're saying about this. Secondly, 